Hi, this is Greg Hughes from 90 Second Website Builder. Here's a video tutorial about the Extension Manager. Now what's unique about this particular video is that it only applies to those of you who are using a full licensed version of 90 Second Website Builder software. In other words, if you're using the trial version, unfortunately this video won't help you because uh, the extensions and the Extension Manager uh, can only be used in the full paid version of the software. But for those of you who have a license and have activated your software, you'll find this extremely helpful. First of all, you may have discovered this extensions tool in the menu up here under tools. You'll see something called the extension manager. Now before I tell you what the extension manager does, let me tell you what extensions are. Extensions are basically other tools that you can add to the toolbox in 90 Second Website Builder. These extensions or add-on tools come from third-party sources. They don't come from Blackwire Marketing or 90 Second Website Builder. They come from a lot of different places around the internet and are made by other companies, third parties. And so the extension manager allows you to see what's available online and literally go and grab those extensions and install them into your software. Now, when you install an extension, it gets placed into your toolbox. I'll scroll down here so you can see. In my software, I have a number of extensions I have installed over the years. And so they will appear down here under the section that says 90 Second Website Builder Extensions. Now, you may not see these in yours because you haven't installed them. In fact, when you first start with 90 Second Website Builder, there's probably no extensions here because you can install the ones you want to use. And the availability of extensions changes from time to time because they come from third parties. So you can see the list of ones that I've installed. So I'm going to show you how to find uh, the current ones that you can install and use if you so please. And we do that, of course, with the extension manager. It's very simple. Here's how it works. You click on this button and you'll get this dialog. The first one says extensions come from third party sources, just so you know. And you can click that little prompt away. Here's what happens. The extension manager shows you uh, all of the extensions, that's why this is selected, that are already installed in my software. So that list that I just showed you in my toolbox over here, uh, all of these down here, are showing right here. And so if I wanted to actually uninstall any of them, I could this easily. In fact, I'll uninstall this one just for demonstration purposes. I click uninstall, say yes, that's it. It's done. So it no longer appears here because I've uninstalled that extension and it's been removed from my toolbox. If I click on the all link that says that is under online gallery, it's going to show me that it's about to retrieve the most recent list of extensions from the internet. So I say yes, give it a couple seconds, and it will now show me all of the extensions that are available to me from third-party sources. And you can see there's a bunch of them. And again, these may change from time to time. They do change from time to time. And they're very easy to work with. This is all of them. If you wanted to look at that in categories, you could select a particular category. So if you just wanted to look at the navigation extensions, it would break those down. And anything you want to install is very simple to do. You would select it, click Install, and you get that extension. Now, sometimes these extensions become permanent tools in future versions of 90 Second Website Builder. As you can see, Mega Menu was once an extension that actually became a permanent tool. So if you're using version 8 or 9, uh, you already have the Mega Menu built into your tools. But at one time, it was an extension. So let me show you some other things that are kind of important in the Extension Manager. Under the Other category, you'll see that there's a link called Available Updates. Now, what this is doing is showing me, in my particular case, that three of the extensions I've installed in my software actually have updates that are available. And if I want to get the latest version of those extensions, I would simply click the Update button, and it would update that extension for me very, very simply. As simple as it is, that's all you have to do to install extensions into uh, version 9 of 90 Second Website Builder. There's one other feature here that I want to draw your attention to that I think is really important for you to know, and that's this manual install. Now, the reason why this is here is because there are some extensions that we have set aside in the members area for you, those of you who have purchased, again, those of you who own a full license of 90 Second Website Builder, you have access to the members area where we have some extensions that are not available 
online to the public and you have to actually download them from the members area and then you would have to manually install them. Well, it used to be that to manually install an extension, you'd have to unpack it, put it in the right part of your computer, put it in the right folder, all that. Well, now the extension manager will actually do that for you once you've downloaded the file onto your desktop. Now I'm going to show you what I mean and then we'll come back and use this manual install. So I'm going to close this up and I'm going to show you how to manually install an extension from the members area and put it into your software. So let's minimize 90 second website builder. Now here I am in the members area and I'm logged in. And again, this is why this only applies to those of you who have purchased a license. Once you're logged in, there's all kinds of resources available to you. And I'm in an area called uh, version 8 extensions. There's also a version 7 extensions. And version 8 extensions actually apply to version 8 and higher. So right now I'm using version 9. And so version 8 extensions would also apply to version 9. There happens to be an extension here that I really, really like. And it's called the background stretcher. And I'm going to get it because it, you cannot get it through the extension manager. It's only available in the members area of 90 Second Website Builder. And Background Stretcher does, does a really, really cool trick on your website. So I'm going to go get it here. You can see I'm scrolling through and showing you that there's a bunch of extensions you can manually download. And it's this one, the one that I want. So I'm just going to click here and save my file here. And so, of course, it's being saved to my Downloads folder. I'm going to go ahead and close out of this window. I'm going to go to my Downloads folder. And you can see I've downloaded this zip folder called Backstretcher. It's actually called Background Stretcher. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to drag this over to my desktop so that we can work with it a little bit easier. So here I am on my desktop. And as you can see, I've placed a zip folder that I've downloaded from the Members area. I'm going to unzip this folder. It's also called Extract. And I do that by right-clicking, going to Extract All, click through the buttons, and here I have an unzipped version of this folder. Okay, let's go back to 90 Second Website Builder. Knowing now that I've downloaded this extension and unzipped it and put it on my desktop, here's what I have to do to install it. I'm back in 90 Second Website Builder. Move the camera up. I'm going to go to the Extension Manager. This is very, very simple, you'll see. And all I have to do is go to Manual Install and now locate that file, which I just did right here. As you can see, it's inside this folder called Backstretcher. Let me go up so you can see where that was. That was actually, remember, on my desktop, there was a folder called Backstretcher. And inside that folder was this file called Backstretcher.wbx. That's what the software is looking for. It's looking for this WBX. Sometimes they're called UWBX files. As you can see down here, it's looking for one of these kinds of files. So I found my WBX file. That means a web builder extension. And all I have to do is say is click the open button here, right here like this. Have to select it first. Click open. It has successfully installed. Click OK. In fact, if we look at all my installed extensions, you can see it already appears there. Let me close out of this. Let's go down to my extensions down here, see if we can find it. And there it is, Background Stretcher. So that is how you would manually install an extension that you can't get from the Extension Manager itself. Most of the time, you'll probably be happy just getting the extensions that are available online simply by going to the Extension Manager, seeing what's available, let it find the latest ones, and if you find one you like, you click on it and install it. So here's an extension that makes a nice uh, sort of ribbon that you can edit with text. That's how you use the Extension Manager. And then just don't forget that that manual install applies to those extensions that are only available to you uh, in the Members area of 90 Second Website Builder. But it makes a much, much easier way for you to install those manually just by simply clicking this button, locating that extension on your computer, and saying OK. So that's how you use the Extension Manager in version 9 of 90 Second Website Builder. Hope you enjoy that.